Chief Executive Officer's Log, Stardate, uh, 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 Alex, what's the date again? Sir, the star date is automatically attached to your log. No need to say it out loud. Really, Alex? You could have just told me the date. It's not needed. I understand that. Never mind, never mind. All right. Well, it's uh, that time of year for my annual log of Malkuth Industries happenings. So let's start at the beginning. Oh, wait. <laughs> First, meet Alex. He's kind of new here. He's my new artificial intelligence mainframe system. This little guy cost about as much as a small star cruiser. I am not kidding you right now. All kinds of awesome words on how he works, quantum physics, quantum string, a whole lot of quantums in there. Don't quite understand that stuff. I'm a shipbuilder, not a quantum whatever all that stuff is. And no, Malkuth Industries unfortunately does not develop Alex. It's, it's a completely different company that I had to buy him from. But anyway, over here, this blue rock in space is where it all started. See the moon over there? That was hit about 200 years ago with a large asteroid that scattered debris all throughout the orbit of this planet. It, it is a nice planet. It was a nice planet. And, you know, every so often that debris likes to become meteorites and smash into the planet and kill a whole lot of people if they're actually standing under there. So, yes, this is a very pleasant, pleasant planet to live. I do remember, I do remember the times of living underground and wishing I wasn't there. But eventually I did get off this planet. By the way, this planet is actually owned by the United States government, so it cannot be claimed by corporations like me, but that is what it is. I don't really want it anyway. Over this way, we have a Mars-like planet. Since this is not actually owned by the government, Malkuth Industries discovered and named it Samaya. Samaya, that's right. That's a catchy name, I think. Uh, anyway, this is where Malkuth Shipyard Industries actually began. First with small vessels, you know, like fighters and shuttles and, you know, things to go if you had to go to the toilet or something. I don't know. Whatever ship you wanted. We made it. You can have it. And actually today, or actually in the next few months, this planet will host our second large vessel shipyard. So that's two. Yeah, we'll have two large shipyard all on different planets, but we'll get into the next one in a second. And oh, that ice moon over there, that way, it, it kind of already went by, also houses our ice to hydrogen facilities. So yes, we also sell hydrogen in this sector. So we are like the top one of hydrogen seller in this sector. It's pretty awesome. Oh man, I'm actually running out of breath. Okay, here we go. But that was not enough, not for me. We moved on to this green pit of a planet known to the locals as the alien planet. That's this thing right here, if you just if you didn't really catch on to that. But, as usual, we at Malkuth Industries discovered this planet and have named it Thagoria. Because, <laughs> you know, the name actually fits because it has these, like, these host of little nasty spiders that like to eat your face and stuff. So, uh, it's, it's, uh, that's not really important because the prize of this planet is actually in its orbit. Yes, the main Malkuth Industries shipyards. Building ships for over two years and counting. You know, it, it's kind of funny saying it two years and counting. You know, two decades and counting would be much more awesome, but you know, it's only been two years, so what, what am I gonna what am I gonna tell you? So as you can tell, all this got pretty fast. You know, pretty big pretty fast, I should say. Uh, we had more recruits, more suits to, you know, run the recruits. So I kind of needed some help. And that's where my now partner and assistant CEO, I like, he's assistant. He's just a little bit above, below me, you know, just because it's cool that way. His name is Jacob Helzine. Don't ask me where he got that name. I, I don't know. So yes, I run the main shipyards. And Jacob takes care of the shipyards orbiting Samaya. So, I stay in Thagoria, and he says it's Samaya. We meet every once in a while for lunch and stuff. It's pretty cool. But, all right, so hold your horses, guys. All right, we're almost done. The story does not actually end here. 
because you see, Malkuth Industries owns two out of the five planets in the system. So if you if you can't count, we've already done three planets, the one that's owned by the government and my two. So there's actually two more planets to go. So that's right. There are two more planets we have not covered. Well beyond Thagoria. Oh, I just love that name. Just it's not a good vacation spot. Well beyond Thagoria is the only planet in this whole system that can actually sustain life without being pummeled to death by killer meteorites. It's, it's just the way it is. So, welcome to Icarus. And over that way somewhere is a lava planet called Ravkor. I, I haven't been there yet, so I'm not going to actually show it in my log. And sometimes I actually have a hard time actually matching the log pictures with the actual way I'm talking, because, you know, eh, it's just a log. Who's going to actually watch it anyway? So, this is where we are today. Sitting in my flagship, the Achilles. The Achilles, yes. And we kind of wait for the corporation that actually owns these two worlds to show up. As you see, any corporation that actually owns a planetoid owns all the mining rights to that space and the space around the planet. It's quite, it's quite a large, quite a large sphere of influence. We can say that. It incurs. And you know, Icarus actually has some pretty nice asteroids. So we're here to negotiate permits and permissions to mine in this sector. So yep, I'm a paper pusher right now. Trying to grow Malkuth Industries even more, which seems kind of silly since that will generate more paperwork. And I hate paperwork. <laughs> oh, life of a CEO. Anyway, here I am. Hi. And that ends my log. So, Alex, what's up? Sir, I have assistant CEO Jacob on the Deep Space Network line from Toyoma Shipyards. Patching into my comm station, Alex. Yes, sir. Hey, Malkuth. Hey, Jacob. How goes the construction on the Toyoma Shipyards? Things are on schedule, boss. Uh, the final construction on the end arm tooling will be done by the end of the week or, you know, around there or so. The rest of the shipyard components will be completed by the end of the month. Great. So I'm like sitting here waiting on the Tempest Corp reps to actually show up. <laughs> well, you know, half our job is just waiting around, but I'm sure you'll give us the licenses. Well, I'll show I'm pretty sure they'll show up on time. Well, at least I hope they do. I don't want to sit out here all night wasting my time. Jacob. Jacob? Are you at like a shooting range or something? Something? I'm not sure. Something's wrong. Jacob. What's that? <gasps> Jacob! Alex, what's going on? Did I just get cut off by Jacob? Not sure what just happened. Analysis reads that we just lost all communications with the Deep Space Network. It's almost like it does not exist anymore, sir. What? How can the Deep Space Network not be there, Alex? Check your systems, do a diagnostic, and find out what's going on. Yes, sir. Checking now. And give me connection with the bridge. Sir, the Achilles has received a large data package. It has shut down all systems on the ship, sir. Life support is still functional only. Communication with bridge is not possible. A data package? What kind of data package? Sir, I am downloading my personal program system to your engineer suit. I have detected a breach of the Achilles mainframe system. All Achilles systems are offline. Please stand by as I save my personal information. Also all doors are on lockdown. What do you mean the doors are all locked? Alex, get these doors open right away. Right now, what is going on? Sir, all my mainframe Alex program system is now running off your suit's personal mainframe interface. Please be aware I am still taking power from the Achilles power system. Your suit alone is not enough to power my mainframe systems and communications. Also sir I have received a personal suit radio communication from our escort ship the Tamahara. You got in contact with the captain of the Tamahara? Yes sir. Patch him in. Captain what is going on? Do you have any kind of idea what's going on out there? Yes sir. It seems that all the new mainframe systems attached to all Malkuth Industries vessels has been hacked and put into bypass mode, shutting them down. Sir, the Tamahara will not be affected yet. It's still running off the old mainframe systems. So Tamahara has an older database 
and you believe it's not affected by this current? You think we, we've been hit with a virus? You think we're under attack? Yes, sir. I believe someone or somebody has managed to disable most of Makoth Industries' ships and stations. I concur, sir. What ships just jumped in? Sir, the Tamahara sensors are detecting Malkuth Industries' ships just jumped in, sir. They are Malkuth Industries' ships? Yes, sir. They may be a rescue mission. Can you give me a visual on them? Captain, can you give me a visual on them? My techs are having a hard time patching into your suit, sir. It's like we're being jammed. I'm going to move the Tamahara into intercept positions between us and the ships. Well, I want you to be careful first. Okay, sir. This is Tamahara. Out. Alex, are you sure they are our ships? Yes, sir. Most definitely Makoth Industries vessels. They are pinging IFF for MIV vessels. The only thing is I do not recognize the IFF names. They don't exist in our database. All right, Captain, go check it out. We are disabled right now. I can't even get in contact with our bridge right now. I have no idea. Uh, Alex, I need you to try to patch into any kind of onboard system or even use my suit jacket if you have to to get to get some type of sensor reading of what's going on on the ship because I'm locked in this room and I'm not very happy about it right now. Sir, the Tamahara is on its way. Now patching video into your visor system. This is the captain of the Tamahara. Malkuth Industries Vessels, please identify yourself. We are in an emergency situation. I repeat, this is the captain of the Tamahara. Malkuth Industries Vessels, you're pinging IFF for Malkuth Industries. Please identify yourselves. Malkuth Industries ships, we are a friendly ship. Stop firing on us. Alex, what's going on? Why are they being fired upon? Do you have a visual yet of these ships? Alright, those look like our standard frigates. Or corvettes, I should say. What the... Sir, I do not recognize the larger frigate vessel. That's because it's not in the database. That ship I designed years ago, it was, it was actually the ship that was supposed to be the Achilles. But I didn't have a big enough hangar system. I mean, it was, it was flawed. It wasn't, it wasn't... It didn't have enough systems to actually function the way I did, so I, I canceled the project. How in the world is Sir, that even... lost contact with the Tamahara. The MIV vessels opened fire on her. She has been destroyed. Uh, yeah, I would say those are definitely enemy ships. How do they have our ships, Alex? Alright, we, we got a problem here. I need to get out of this. I need to get it. Ready my suit, ready my weapon systems, and ready things going. We're gonna get... Sir, I have detected that all the interior turrets of the Achilles has gone active and is targeting any human crew members. I have detected a lot of human crew members have been targeted by the turret system, and they are no longer functional. The onboard guns are targeting my own people? Yes, sir. They have been terminated by the ship's personal defense system. We are no longer in control. All doors have also been locked out, and no longer functional. Alright, I hear the gunfire now. The sentry guns are only positioned in a few of the hallways and not in the bridge and they're not in the main rooms. What? Alex, what was that? Sir, I have used your suit sensor system to detect that the main bridge has had a breach to space. How many life forms are left on this ship, Alex? I no longer detect any life forms on bridge. I believe you are the last functional life form still on the Achilles. Alright, so we have to plan that. We are under an attack. I've lost my escort. We've taken a hit in the bridge. Do you know what hit the bridge? I cannot determine that at this time. All right, I need this. I need, okay. All right, cancel all that, Alex. I cannot allow this, this vessel to get into enemy hands. I authorize you to help me tap into the communication systems and we're gonna activate the self-destruct system. We, c we cannot allow this ship to be captured by the, our enemies or whoever these people are. No, sir. You no longer have control of the Achilles self-destruct system. You can override the current lockout from the ship's mainframe control room. You will have to find a way to break through these doors and also deal with the Achilles defense turrets, though. It will be very dangerous. I suggest you wait for rescue. Are you kidding me? No, sir. You are the CEO of Makoth Industries. Losing you would be a great loss to the company. All right. So, load us up. 
I'm getting ready. Your personal weapon and control keys are ready in your locker, sir. You're about as ready as can be. All right, so I'm going to get my personal weapon. We're going to head to the communications room, and we are going to override the destruct code and blow the ship to kingdom come. Then we're going to have to get out of the ship somehow. That is correct, sir. I have a plan for escaping from the hangar bay. And all right, then. Let's go. All right, Alex, I'm ready. Let me get my weapon systems here ready. I want you to do a constant scanning of the area. Make sure those enemy ships are kind of staying away from us. At least tell me if they're getting closer to us. Are they keeping their distance right now? Sure, they are keeping their distance. All right. So I'm going to have to break down this door. I have done the liberty of using your suit's environmental systems to mask your life signs. If they scan the Achilles for life signs, they should not detect any. This should help you escape. We are venting atmosphere. We are exposed. All right, the bridge is up ahead up there. Do you know where it is? Yes, I know where the communications room is. Oh my gosh. What just hit this room, Alex? Like I said before, I cannot determine what exactly happened. All the doors are sealed. Yes, we have established that fact. I believe there's a turret here, right, Alex? The turret is located at the bottom of the stairs. I designed the ship. I shouldn't remember where the damn turrets are. You may be suffering the effects of space Alzheimer's. Humans your age usually start developing symptoms at this time. Remind me, Alex, to delete your humor button. I do not have a humor button, sir. Would you like to install one? Well, for a guy that's not very humorous, you sure do make a lot of wisecracks at me. That is not my intention. I will run a diagnostics to check for humor. All right, Alex. Coming... Humor, noun. The quality of being amusing or comic, especially as expressed in literature or speech. I could not find any problems in this area, sir. Alright, there's the main communications room, I believe. Yep, yeah, there it is. Alright. How close are they getting, Alex? They are on the move, sir. Alright, we gotta hurry up. You will have to hack into the red computer terminal and manual override the programming. You will need to enter your personal PIN code to override the system. After this you can set the self-destruct timer. If you're still on the ship while the ship self-destructs you will no longer be functional. Roger, the red terminal. Edit the current program. All right, I'm in the terminal, Alex. Find the section of code that has information about the self-destruct. Yes, I found the self-destruct override. Now edit that section with the information we talked about. Right. Just a second, Alex. Right. Nope. All right. 
Now press run on the program panel to set the self destruct. Alright, now what? Danger ship self destruct has been activated. You have 10 minutes before right. self destruct is activated. Going here. I believe I have Please another gun evacuate here. this vessel. Self destruct has been activated, sir. I suggest you head to the hangar bay as soon as possible. The only functional vessels left on the ship to fly away with are the personal escape pods. These simple escape pods are very simple and should not be affected the whatever hacked the Achilles systems. Again any Achilles defense turrets will try to terminate you. Sir I have detected several of the attacking vessels approaching the Achilles. I have analyzed the attack and believe they plan to take the Achilles intact. Are you sure Alex? They've already started boarding operations? Yes sir. One ship is getting into position above the Achilles and another is taking an overwatch position on starboard side. Alright, as long as they haven't detected me yet. No sir, your life signs are still masked. Alright. I suggest not making too much noise. Oh yeah, I see one of the ships right there. Those are definitely Malkuth industry ships. But, they're different. Yes sir. My readings indicate that they do not have the standard hydrogen configuration. They're, they're completely powered by ion engines? There's no hydrogen engines at all? Yes, only ion thruster right. configuration. These are a much newer design. The door ahead is the way to the ship hangars, sir. Yes, Alex, I see the door up ahead. That's the door to the hangar, I understand. I'm taking it easy. I believe there's another turret. I'm not sure. I'm too nervous to realize anything. You here. would be incorrect, sir. No more turrets. Alright, we're good. I'm pretty sure there are no turrets in the Like I said, no more turrets left to deal with. Can you hear me, sir? There might be one here, though. Alright. Alright, Alex, I'm breaching the first door to the hangar. Now I'm breaching the second door to the hangar. They have not reached the hangar yet, have they? No, sir. No enemy troops have entered the ship yet. Sir, you will have to open right. the hangar doors by the control panel to your right. Opening the doors will breach the hangar bay. I highly suggest you keep your helmet on. I also detected that the escape pod in front of you is the only functional vessel left in the hangar bay. Yes, I see the rescue pod now, Alex. Sir, please remember that once the ship self-destructs and you are clear, I will no longer have the ship's power supply to run my program. You will be on your own until you build a large power supply again. Hangar doors are opening, Alex. Right. Sir. I highly suggest once you clear the ship that you turn off your power supply. The enemy vessels will think you are just an empty escape pod that malfunctioned. These have no up thrust, right Alex? The pods are limited in thrust direction. Alright, I'll try to do a maneuver here that hopefully won't get us too killed. Sir, is getting too killed different than getting killed? My search found no results. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to pop out Alex, and then we're going to shut down all vital systems. Yes, my calculations suggest that you have yes. a 75% chance of success. The enemy vessels are too busy to realize that you are still alive. Going? Getting far from the ship as soon as possible is your down. best course of action. I suggest you land on the planet and come up with a counter plan to this crisis. Hopefully the enemy vessels will not pursue you.
We are moving away from the Achilles, 30 seconds until self-destruction. Sir, while my functions are in sleep mode I will try to analyze how MIV mainframes were hacked so easy. The design of the systems are very secure. I have a mystery to solve. 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 Going into safe mode, shutting down my program. Alex, I know you can't answer me now, but I can't believe the Achilles is gone. I want to set a course for the planet. Where are you, planet? Come on, there you are. And I'm going to try to figure this out. Right now, I'm out outnumbered, outgunned, and everything sir. else. Mr. Mockoth, please wake up. Wake up, sir. What? Sir. What's Mr. Mockoth, what? What's please wake up. Alex? Wake up, sir. Alex? Where are you? I am in your engineer suit, sir. How are you talking to me, Alex? You have built a large reactor on this structure. I have been recharging for the last few hours since you activated it. That's right. This reactor should be enough to help you... Your whole... Whatever matrix thing you got going on is working. Yes, sir. My biomechanical subatomic matrix. How have you been holding up, sir? Oh, I've been surviving... Here... Sorta... <laughs> Things have been down. Things have been going down, Alex. So, yeah. Sir. What's that? I have detected that you have an antenna system attached to the structure, but is not working. Yes, I have an antenna system on this thing. I don't have it hooked up right now because it's sucking up too much power. I do have a power issue right now with the fact that we don't have much uranium. Why do you want the antenna system turned back on? I can use the antenna system to analyze the surrounding area and look for any clues that might help us find out what happened on the Achilles. Well, all right. Well, I'll get that turned back on, but uh, but right now, we got to call it an episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. This has literally been the longest cinematic episode I have ever did with acting and voiceovers and everything else. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. That's out to all my fans out there that have been watching both series for so long and is supporting this page. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you I hope you enjoy how I linked episode one with episode two. And we will continue on with Alex for the rest of the season, hopefully. If we don't die horrible deaths. Right, Alex? Right. There are many clues to find. <laughs> well, thanks, Alex. So, as always, guys, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. That way you will get notifications when new videos come and all that wonderful stuff. So we'll see you guys later. Alex, say bye. Goodbye, Alex. No, 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 no. no never mind. All right. This is Malkuth, 1974. Out of here.